I'm Sarah Douglas and I'm a Canadian sailor. I compete internationally in the World Cup circuit and European circuit and a bit all over the world. My goal is to win a medal at the next Olympic Games in Tokyo 2020. Everything that I do in a day revolves around sailing and being the best person that I can be. So everything is pushing me to be the best in the gym and on the water. I'm just trying to be the best in the world and, and do, do what I love at the same time. Hi, Sarah. I'm Raquel, and I'm here this morning to help you to get the suit on. The purpose of the suit is to help you to feel what it's like to be an elderly person or someone who has lost some form of their abilities. How does that feel? Is that difficult? Very heavy. I'm definitely feeling weaker. Really blurry. I've lost my peripheral vision. I can see how easy? much harder that is. It's crazy. How do you feel? It's feeling pretty heavy. Can't see very well, and I cannot hear very well either. We're going to get you to do some activities that you typically would do in your daily routine. My daily schedule, I actually spend a lot of time doing emails and logistics, budgeting. It's actually pretty hard to type each letter and not mess it up. It's a little bit hard to read. Kind of blurry and, and all a bit yellow. And then there's lunch, you're always preparing food and making sure you're eating right and getting the right nutrition. It's a little difficult to see and a little nerve wracking. I think it just takes a little bit longer and you have to be really careful with knives and making sure you're safe. In the laser radial being so physically demanding, you need to make sure that you're injury free. So we spend a lot of time stretching and making sure we have the proper technique. This is my hiking bench. I go on this a couple times a week and this kind of simulates sailing and I'm just gonna try it out with the suit. Already it's, I'm shaking a bit and it's harder and holding my arms out here is also a lot harder. Usually I'm able to hold it for a couple minutes and today I couldn't even hold it past 30 seconds. Imagine what it would feel like if this was your life all the time. It would be exhausting. It would be frustrating. Our goal at Providence Healthcare is to provide empathy training to all our staff, go through the experience of what it's like to walk in the patient's shoes. For Providence to be helping people that are in this state and to help them with their mobility and doing their daily tasks, it's really heartwarming. And knowing that someone has their back, it's just great to hear that there is that support. I almost can't imagine the amount of strength that you need to do this every day.